Hey guys, so Neutrogena recently launched an extension of their Hydro Boost Hydrating Lip Shine line. I have five new shades in front of me. I figured I would do a lip swatch video for you guys. And this is what they all look like. So if you guys are curious to see swatches on the arm and on the lips, then just keep watching. And if you guys want to know what I have on my face today, I am wearing the Superstay Better Skin Foundation in the shade 20 Classic Ivory on my face. Topped off with a little bit of the Marc Jacobs Perfection Powder under the eyes and a little bit of the Ruby Kisses Never Touch Up Matte Finish Powder in light beige on my cheeks. I'm wearing an H&M blush in like brown sugar, I think it's called. And I used this Essence Contour Powder Bronzer for my contour and bronzing today. Okay, so let's start off with number 15. This is True Nude. No real detectable smell. They have a flat paddle wand. Here's True Nude right here. It is pretty much exactly what it's saying. True Nude. Oh, they're really hard to get in and out of here. They have a nice slick feel to them. I find this a bit frustrating to actually get the wand back in. You really have to apply some force. Um, but here is number 15, True Nude. Next up, we have number 27, Almond Nude. So we have True Nude and Almond Nude right here. You don't get much on this paddle. Here is Almond Nude. Pretty much like a Your Lips color. Next up we have 23 Ballet Pink. Here is ballet pink, but I would call this more of like a corally pink. Next up is number 90, pink mocha. I got a lot more on the paddle with this particular color. I wonder if there was a different, I wonder if there was different packaging for this one versus the others. But here is Pink Mocha. And finally, we have number 80, Deep Cherry. Here is Deep Cherry. These have a very slight crayon essence to them, but very, very, very subtle. If you're not licking your lips, you're probably not even gonna notice it. And even then you may not. Um, so there's no added fragrance that I can detect, no added scent that I can detect, just that very slight kind of like waxy flavor, but nothing strong. You can barely detect it. So I don't think you'll mind if you're sensitive to fragrances, chemical tastes, things like that. Very, very, very subtle. But 
they feel really nice they're not sticky they're not like greasy feeling they're just like a nice healthy gloss which i mean healthy boost hydrating lip shine it's exactly what they are and it says lips look and feel hydrated for 24 hours with hyaluronic acid which is good for plumping so i think these are really nice there's quite a color range i mean you have red down to neutrals peaches to browns there's a color for everyone in this line from what i'm seeing you've got neutrals and colors i think these work well by themselves you can kind of get I would say an almost opaque color, but they'd be beautiful as toppers as well. So I'm definitely gonna start playing with these and add them to my lip rotation. These are very nice and I can't wait to see if they do provide hydration and color all day long. So I hope you guys enjoyed this swatch video of the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Lip Shine Glosses. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. I just realized I forgot to swatch this one on my hand. So there you have it. There is Deep Cherry and the rest of the gloss swatches. Bye for real this time.